Back everybody to panic mode averted. Uh, this is Starfield. I am the preacher. And the last time I had to hurry up and hang up because I said my power had been cut off. That was a mistake. I do have a battery box on my computer that gives me about maybe seven to ten minutes of runtime. So when I saw the lights go out, I had to do a quick save <laughs> and shut everything down before suddenly realizing that the reason the lights went out is because they were on a timer, and in order to save electricity, they went out. <laughs> so, crisis averted, no power lost, and uh, we can just pick up at the research labs right where we were. A ship's reactor is the single source of power for an entire ship, so try not to lose it. Single source, that means you can't have two reactors, I'm guessing, or maybe you can later on. All right, we are here. Um, we were just getting ready to pick a lock, weren't we? Yes, yes, yes. I think we were going to try. Um, even though I've wasted, I'll take that nutrient. In fact, what I'm going to do is nutrient. Ooh, would that help? Okay, so what happens if I take rare organic resource? This item can be used as a component in crafting. Tried through medication used to treat afflictions. I don't need black licorice. 10% O2 recovery for three minutes. Cheese restores three health. Why not? Um, look at that. It looks like a good gun. All right. Is it a fingerprint reader on the side, on the back there? I can't quite tell. It'd be a bad place for one. But anyhow, uh, fiber... I still haven't figured out how to throw the frag grenades. Ooh. A medicated cream for treating burns and frostbite. Okay, so this is not just for he healing points. That is. Molecule extractor. Basic. Boost pack. I don't have one equipped, right? Compared to equipped? Oh, I have a tunnel mining pack. Airborne 5, this is Airborne 0. Pirate Survival. Okay, wait a minute. So, it... It, it doesn't add anything to... Well, the Pirate Survival Pack gives you better thermal and corrosive protection. A little less radiation protection. Is valuable. Slightly heavier. EM is 30. Um, should I... I don't know if I should favorite it. It was a Rattler. 27 caliber. 40 rounds. Look at that. It looks cool. Ham. All right. Let's, let's have some common organic resource can be used as a component in crafting. All right. Um, well, let's go to... Can I... No? I don't like the fact... That I have to... I, I can't... While I'm here in the new items... I can't... I can favorite it, I guess. But, like, if I wanted to use this, I can compare it. Oh, no, A does equip it. Okay. Well, let's go back down to that pirate survival pack at C. I ran out of O2. Further exertion will cause CO2 buildup. Fun. All right. You're dead. We're all dead. The comms relay has been trashed. The whole room is trashed. We can't call for help. I can hear the terror morph roaring somewhere. And more people screaming. <laughs> We're dead. Okay. We're all dead. Well, I've got six digit picks. The whole room is trashed. We can't call for help. I can hear the terror morph roaring somewhere. And more people screaming. <laughs> okay, well, we'll just start there, I guess. Let's see. But it's not that... Set. I could use that set. And there we go. 
Can I rotate these around? Doesn't. Oh, maybe this. Okay. I really like the idea of an auto undo. I truly do. Okay. Um. 379 credits. Take all. Yes. An isotopic coolant. Can be used in component crafting. Okay, deal with the Crimson Fleet Captain. Um, I can't do a whole lot of more because apparently my CO2 is up. So I'm a little bit concerned about that. So let's go ahead. I can I save that since I just got into the safe and let's see what do I got here I've got 20 out of 26 health or is that 20 out of 26 I hope this this is a conversation and not a fight but I'll take what I get I guess and a dish rag Storage entrance. Yeah, that's 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 all stuff down there. I bet you I'm gonna have to fight the xenomorph or whatever it's called. Terror, terror morph. That would be terrifying. Uh, okay, sorry about that. Uh, only a little bit. Hey, med kits. Those are good. Synapse Alpha. All right. Ooh, anti ballistic. Navigator, space, I'm going to guess that's helmet, rip shank, iso-centered magnet, argon, and fiber. What does that mean? Ooh. Anti-ballistic navigator space helmet. Can I compare to equipped? Deep mining. Uh, a little less physical boost or whatever. Thermal boost, corrosive burr boost. Not minus 15% incoming physical damage from ranged weapons. Well, that's not what I want right now. I'll take it, but I don't want it. I'll take it, but I don't want it. Okay. And is there anything I can see by scan? Let's see here. This is just more... Oh. I just got into the farm kit. Yeah, I just did that. Okay. Well, let's... Uh, Let's open the door and see. Oh, I'm right back up where I was. Uh, can I see around corners or anything silly like that? That'd be really cool if I could. You gotta be kidding me. The Frontier has a new captain? You working with Barrett or did you pry the ship keys out of his cold dead hands? I'm with the Constellation. You need to stop attacking our ship. That's right, I killed Barrett, so tell your pirate friends to back off. Enough talk, I have places to be. What's your problem with Barrett anyways? You know, I'm a little inclined to go here. We don't have a problem with Barrett. We want that ship, the Frontier. If you're the captain of it now, that means we're after you. Well, I'd, I'd rather not. Oh, <laughs> You see, maybe your colleague Barrett didn't tell you, but there's a bit of a legend surrounding that ship. That constellation keeps treasure hidden in the cargo bays, the loot from a hundred planets, and it's going to be ours. That statement is partially correct. The Frontier has been to many planets and moons, but the only things held in the cargo bays are spare parts, dust, desiccated food particles, and a variety of species of ant. I don't care what kind of lies Barrett programmed that robot to say. We're taking that ship. I'd kind of prefer you didn't, man. Okay. Well, this is where my decision to prefer the persuasion skill, or whatever it's called, ahead of time, may pay off. You're not talking us out of this score. I would to persuade a person you need to make successful choices choices can range from kind words to distractions to threats each choice has a difficulty the higher the difficulty the greater the chance the choice fails but the more points you earn when you succeed 
You have a limited number of choices you can make, but you can never fail if your last choice succeeded. Uh, if you want to trade ships, that sounds good to me. The Frontier creaks when it turns anyway. I'm looking forward to tearing you apart. I'm not sure that's 100%. Sure, auto-persuade is an option? Are you serious? Uh, okay. I... I, I don't think he's going to be dissuaded from threat of violence. I'm not falling for that. Your ship is loaded, and we want it. Hmm. Let's see here. They aren't? You sure? <laughs> Pretty positive. Uh, take a moment to count how much you see. That's not really what I'm after here. That's, that's not the kind of player I am. I would much rather talk to somebody. Uh, the ship doesn't have anything on it. You're chasing fairy tale. Oh, that, that can't be right. It is. Look, you can come aboard the Frontier right now. See for yourself. There's nothing on it. Ooh, that might actually be a good option. I'm not falling for that. That's got ambush written all over it. Except it doesn't. I've heard enough out of you. Kill them! Captain, protocol indigo dictates that I am to return to the log. Come on. Oh, come on, I'm loading. All right, well, you're somewhere over here. Deal with the Crimson Fleet, Captain. I would like to do some healing before I do. Yeah, yeah, you are. Press travel to your ship. Press left button to open the scanner. Not ready to do that yet. Okay. You guys need to stop. Okay. Cancel that. All right. Now what? Now what? Is, do I need to fast travel? Is that what it's telling me? This is like a this is like a thing I have to do now. Um, where are the corpses of my people? Analyzers, Star Roman, space helmet. All right, Vasco, where you at, dude? I could open the scanner, but right now, what I want to do. Look for the map icon of your ship and press A over it. Okay, so they're trying to teach me how to do a fast evac. But I'd rather do some fighting, <laughs> even though I'm not good at it. Why is there a portable desk fan out here? That makes sense. Exploration requires so much bloodshed. I kind of agree with you there, dude. Okay, what do we got here? Helium. Um... Apparently, I'm going to be encumbered if I take that. Helium dispenser. What do I need helium for? Uh, I don't understand what I'm doing there, but I'm going to go ahead and do it because I can. All right. Um...
I really like just roasting people. Alright, that didn't work. Okay, scanner. Press A over my ship. Where's it at here? In combat. There it often yells. I am not sure why. I can probably figure it out. Press A over it. That's my ship. Carrying too much and can't fast travel? Alright, let me use up some... Let me use up some equipment then. How do I do that? New items. What do we got here? Argon. Um, Star Roamer space helmet. Alright, some of this stuff is going to be useful. Modified Grendel. Okay. Let's go into weapons and see. Damage 4. Equinox. I have 46 rounds for that. Let's equip that. And... Let's see what I got here. Rescue Axe. Let's drop a few of these. Right? And that should do it. Can I now? Fast travel to selected location. Yes, I guess. I don't know why I'm doing that, but I'm going to... Captain, we should now be free to travel to Constellation's headquarters without Crimson Fleet interference. Fast travel directly from the missions menu. Press... This will all become second nature before too long. I doubt it. Okay. Uh, let's go to mission then. One small step. X will automatically plot my course to the next location. Alpha Centauri Ptolemon. X to jump. Okay, let's do that. So the Crimson Fleet's going to keep looking for me. We figured that much out. Entering patrolled area, no contraband on ship, wait for scan. Uh, okay. Starship Frontier, this is United Colony Security. Maintain course and prepare to be scanned. Uh, fine. Scan complete. No contraband detected. You are cleared for landing at New Atlantis. Cool, I guess. If that's what I'm here for. I will land on New Atlantis after I look around. I want to look around. Can I look around? Oh, man. Ooh. That's a big dot. I want to see the moon. Well, okay. No, no, no. Let's go to New Atlantis. Let's go to New Atlantis. That's what we're going to do today. And, uh... Plan to go to the map, go to, uh, show me what I'm doing. Ooh, 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 a civilian outpost. I kind of want to land there first. I'll do it later. Ooh, what was that? A science outpost. Okay. New Atlantis. Set the landing target. Right? And, uh, Jemison, New Atlantis. I guess, I guess it's all the same, right? I land at New Atlantis. Kind of what I'm trying to do? I'm looking at this icon here, and I'm looking at this little icon there, and I'm trying to figure out exactly which one of those. Let's scan this. I'm trying to figure out which one of those is... Where I really want to land? Chlorine. All right. Well, let's just go ahead and set the landing target and do the jump. During the Colony War, UC Admiral Francois Sanon ordered the bombing of Londinian to halt the city's terror morph outbreak. Okay. Good war stuff. Go to the lodge. Mass district. Not gonna lie, it's cool. All right, let's get up. I want to offload some of my equipment and put it in the storage hold. If I can. Uh, first things first, navigation console. What happens if I click? Oh, okay. That's not. Get out, get out, get out, get out. All right, let me do a little bit of. There we go. Inventory management, cargo hold, left button, 
can see all the stuff that's in there. And let's go ahead. I'm back over here. And resources. Let's. Can I store all resources? RB. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. All. Laser cartridges. All kinds of stuff here that I don't know what to do with. But. Deep mining space helmet. Um. I mean, Analyzer's Star Roamer Space Helmet, epic. 20% oxygen capacity and Analyzer, 10% damage to scan targets. Anti-ballistic incoming damage from ranged weapons. It's not a very good anti-ballistic. It takes, oh, you it takes 15% less damage. I was interpreting that totally backwards. You know what? I am going to leave it where I'm at. Let's just go and do the next thing. Uh, how do I... There we go. Stand on that door and open it. It's a good plan. New Atlantis. Yeah. I'm sure they are. Vasco, what do you got to say, buddy? Captain, Constellation will be waiting for you at the lodge. Fantastic. Why is the Crimson Fleet captain after Barrett? I have often asked Barrett that same question at various times and about various individuals that wanted to cause us harm. The most likely answer is that Barrett personally insulted him, mm -hmm. typically by continuing to live, usually after escaping from certain death and often with an object multiple people wanted. Sounds roughly accurate. Constellation is an explorer's society founded over 50 years ago with the mission of seeking out the unknown. Members often engage in expeditions in small groups, typically one or two people, or like Barrett and myself, one person and one robot. The membership is intentionally limited and small. Should you join Constellation yourself, you will be the 10th active member. That's not a lot of people. Barrett would say that billions of years ago, we were all one with the cosmos. So technically, you have known each other forever. But the more practical answer is likely that he needs you. The number of known people who have been affected by the artifacts is now two. Without your investment in Constellation's mission, he may never know more about the experience you both share. So, he is showing you trust in order to gain your support. Let's trade gear. I am ready to commence a trade. Really? Uh, so he can carry some of my inventory stuff. Three kilovolt laser cartridge. Well, he's been shooting lasers. Does that mean that this helps him? I don't want to take it. Left button inventory. Um, ammo. Three kilovolt laser. Oh, I got 46 of those. I don't know. Let's just leave it at that for right now. Okay. Well, here is my quest. And uh, is there anything around about here that I care about? No? All right, let's have this ship services technician. And here's our new captain. My crew can take a look at your ship. And you can stop by the Trade Authority kiosk if you need to offload some cargo. I have no clue. It cost me a thousand crap. I don't even know how much I have. My ship needs some repairs. I'd like to view and modify my ships. Oh, my goodness. Let me see what ships you have for sale. Where can I go if I need more crew for my ship? Oh, wait a minute. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. This is a whole other realm. Everything looks good here. I'll be at my booth if you need me. Wait. Status. Can I, how do I, how do I, is it just right in the middle? Do you see credits on this anywhere? Um, no. Health, skills, inventory, star map, ship. Where's my, oh, status, why? Status effects. Uh, character. Um, hero worshipped. You really need your time. Oh, wait. 
And you know what? It, it occurred to me after I uh, created my character that I didn't need to add the wanted thing to me. So you know that's that that's going to be a, a needless problem. But it's okay. Uh, most credits carried, thirty-four k. All right. No, uh, 3,400. That's not 34K. 3.4K would be appropriate. Um, well, I mean, I don't know. Grab jumps, maximum owned, most expensive shipped owned. That's 59,000 credits. Ship sold and built. Okay, combat. Ooh. I, I really wasn't looking for uh, a whole bunch of... Favorite weapon cutter. Yes, it actually is. I, I really like just roasting people. Okay. Um, I I guess I could see how much a, a ship costs. Hey, what can I do for you? Let's see how I'm much. I'm sure a ship you can costs. find something you like. Uh, vendor credits seventy two thousand. How do I have 72,000 vendor credits here? Okay, so this is... Uh, the Rambler is 57,000 credits. The Galileo, 132,000 credits. I like it. The Responder, 65,000 credits. I'm a long way away from doing any such thing. Uh, ship Overview, the Econo Hall. It's an interesting... Interesting name. The Shield Breaker. Lots of lasers, I'm guessing. Okay. I don't know if I'm going to do uh, a ton of intentional combat. That's uh, that's interesting. Okay. My ship needs some repairs. Does it? I really don't know about the status of the ship. Let me look at it real quick. No, wrong button. Ah, uh, hold on. And the ship. Here we go. Ship overview, 50. The hull is at 326. Cargo. We're almost at half cargo capacity. Um, maybe I'm not going to do anything to the ship just yet. I guess. That makes a good idea. So there's his kiosk, and he'll be there. All right. You see, security I can and safety. You, this unprovoked attack on a United Colonies research facility will not go unanswered. We'll get you settled into your new assignments as soon as possible. For you, Bobby, that includes meeting your new foster parent. My parents aren't dead. They just took a different shuttle. I'll see them when they get here. Oh, uh, well, of, of course, uh, that's sure possible. <laughs> uh, we'll, ju uh, we'll just. <clears throat> Helena Chambers, ID SSCOM 1327 HCHA. I'm I was the station administrator. This. I'll need to report to Mast ASAP for a full debrief. My treatment thus far has been entirely unacceptable. Oh boy. Any authority you had was forfeit the moment House Varun Zealots breached the station's perimeter and you failed to initiate proper evacuation protocols. Thank you for your service. We'll find you a new position commensurate with your experience. Oh, that was harsh. And Mr. Bosch, let me just say how honored I am to meet you. By all accounts, you're the only reason anyone made it out of there alive. Hmm. Well, just glad I still remembered my flight basics. It had been a while. So was shooting a gun. I read all about New Atlantis. So cool! Is it true that the Nat train goes 5,000 miles an hour? Or that citizens get special discounts? Or that the whole city celebrates when it's your birthday? Mine's June 11th, by the way. My parents took me to Aquila City last year, and it kind of smelled. But I don't smell anything here. Okay, well, they're just going to um, keep going about their no, business. Yes, no. Um, I don't think I need to wear my helmet. Can I take my helmet off? How do I do that? Uh, gear. Bump bomb. Helmet. And let's hope I don't die. Oh, yeah. Okay. You see that scientist out in front of Mast? Staring at trees? Sounds upset? Whatever it is. Can't be that bad, You'll right? Scanned as you enter the city. Please keep moving. Talk to the scientist by the tree. Uh. Okay. No bounty. You're clear. 
for your visit. No bounty on me, huh? Okay, let's take a look at New Atlantis. It is an interesting place to be sure. I have no idea what I'm doing here. We got citizens. Uh, let's figure out where this fellow by the tree is. Um, da -da 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 -da. I guess I'm going to the star map, going to missions, activities. Talk to the scientist by the tree. Let's set a course for that guy. That's that's not what I know. Uh, talk to the scientist by the tree. Okay, so now if he is marked on my... Can I just exit? That means he is now this way. Okay. Let's go talk to the scientist by the tree and see what he has to say. Do I need to wear my spacesuit right now? As a matter of fact. Nobody else is. But I'm sure they're used to it. This is New Atlantis Transit, or the NAT. It provides free transportation throughout the city. We I like can free. take it directly to the Mast District. Uh, I guess Mast District. So this is this is how they're going to do fast travel. I get it. I can appreciate that. So far, I'm just really enjoying uh, getting a feel for the atmosphere of the game. And, uh... Okay. All right, all right, all right. There's a... You know what? What happens if we just talk to somebody? How's it going? Um, going all right. Thanks for asking. Have a nice day. How about you? Hello. Pardon me. Uh, yeah, the okay. The water is quite aesthetically pleasing. Or so Barrett has told me. New yeah. Atlantis relies on advanced hydroelectrics for most of its power. All right, here's a scientist talking about a tree. I really want to see it. Hi. Uh, hello? I'm sorry, I really can't afford to be distracted. I need to get to the bottom of this. You seem to be staring at a tree. I am not staring. I am analyzing. This is important xenobiological work. Oh, I'm a tree. I work for the work. scientific division of MAST. I've been studying this tree for quite some time, and it appears to be exhibiting some worrying signs. Hmm. Are you familiar with this particular specimen? Do you understand its importance? Look, I have a lot of work to do here. If you're just going to gawk, I'd ask that you move on. If you can actually assist me, however, I would appreciate it. I don't normally solicit help from random passersby, but it seems an exception is necessary. Would you be willing to retrieve some additional data for me? You know what? I'd love to help. Uh... Well, that's... Thank you. That's unexpected. Ah, there's a series of biosensors I've placed in various locations around New Atlantis, all calibrated to gather pertinent information. They've been running for long enough that I think it's time to collect and analyze their findings. If you would bring them to me, that would save time. Save time for you? But it's going to cost me some serious effort. Oh, look at all of them. They're everywhere. All right. Hello? Return of the Interceptor broke box office records with its release. The latest Interceptor movie... Also okay. All right. Return of the Interceptor. Um... It appears I could go that way. I, I could go all the ways. Okay, hold on there. Hold on there. Which button do I use just to load a map? No. All right, let's take a look here at the various things I need to do. I need to go. There's not one here. There's one over there. There's one over there. One over there. And uh, one over here. And, you know, I know. Ooh, ooh, there are things to do here. There are things to do, and I don't know what I'm doing. So, I guess if I'm going to do anything, I've got to go back to this. All right, let's just go do the next thing, I guess. I I can't help it. It looks like I'm going to be stuck doing some side quests already. And side quests don't bother me too much as long as they're not merely busy work. I might learn something. All right, let's go to the residential district. Why not?
All right, this makes sense. It's not what you would call open world or maybe even open universe. But 46 meters in yonder direction. We have the residential district. And uh, something happening in the tree. A biosensor. All right. That means I got to go find another one. And another one. And another one. All right, we can do this. Let's go get a biosensor and take it to the sky. Maybe there's uh, maybe there's something useful that's going to... Oh, is there something over here? Hold on. Hold on. I'm hoping that... Uh... uh Okay, here's one. A little closer. Come on. All right. What else have we got? Um, hi there, Vasco. Where do I go? This. Should I follow this one? Or how many do I need to follow? Is there one in this part of town? I don't know. I'm just gonna see if I can burn my CO2 stuff up. All right. Yeah, I know we're starting to have trouble. Gaining CO2, you'll take damage instead. Okay. On this side or that side? Here we go. Uh, when do I need... I don't know. Is there any more of those showing up? I mean, there is a marker... Ahead of me, I guess. Am I going this way? I mean, it is in this direction. Up to the right, perhaps? Should I... Let's go look at the map. And look at the... Sur Whoop. I guess I want the surface map. Okay, everything else, I need to go to the lodge. And... Biosensors over here. So, can I? Can I locate the biosensors? Show them on the map. That's not what I want to do. Doggone. All right. Well, let's just keep going in this direction then, I guess. Right? Wait a minute. It went. It went away. Uh, did I? Show all targets. Ah, okay. So there is whatever this is. So I gotta go find. The mass district is kind of explored. Residential district is explored. I I guess this is where I'm headed. Locate the biosensors. And it's kind of in front of me. So, let's just keep on keeping on, I guess. Oh, wait. Uh, I can see it on the screen there in front of me. Do I need to go through here? Uh, I see it over there. Hopefully this takes a left-hand turn here in a moment. All right. Uh, you can jump in trees? Jumping from such a height is dangerous for your endoskeleton. Yeah, yeah it is. Okay. All right. Apply for a job at Reun Industries kiosk. Uh, maybe I'll do that later. Ugh. Wish that bartender at the viewport would stop complaining to security. Wow. I don't know what she lost, but she won't get it back by difference. annoying us. I can easily see how you can spend... Talk to the bartender at viewport. Okay. All right, 70 meters. Somehow in this direction. I could easily see how you could just get totally, totally absorbed. I, I could see myself losing lots of hours. Hey there with this game. So, 
I've only got a, a few of these in. I would like to know what are you thinking so far of... Oh! That's not a biosensor. Hey, are you looking for eggs too? Uh, I've only found one so far, but I want to find more before anyone else does. So if you see some, can you tell me? Uh, I'm looking for biosensors, not eggs. The egg you found wasn't beeping, was it? Yeah, it was. Weird, right? Miss Seng over at UC Distribution bought the one I found, and she said she might buy more if I can find them. I could really use the credits. Well, hold, hold on there, dude. Jordan. We're not supposed to talk to strangers. You just talked to me. Boo! <laughs> Did I scare you? Uh, no. I hope I'm as cool as Solomon Co. when I grow up. I have my serious doubts. Okay, um... So, Miss Tsang, huh? I gotta go find Miss Tsang. Let's go do it. I probably don't want to jump down, right? Because falling from such a height can be dangerous to my health. Health? All right. Let's uh, let's just run down the ramp here and uh, see if now maybe. I did not mean to do that. I'm glad you can. So much to see. But I didn't mean to. All right, Miss Sang. Let's see about these eggs that you've got, huh? I love the bridge. I love that bridge. You see, Distro Center. All right. Looking for Miss Tsang. Um. Please, if you experience any issues in your dealings with the distribution center, let us know. We're always striving to improve. Indeed. Welcome to UC Distribution. Now, before you say a word, I am required to inform you that formal complaints cannot be filed until the customer feedback system is back online. I have been told it'll be up and running in two weeks, but Fine. you know how these things are. I am sorry for any potential inconvenience. Complain, but also, you can't complain. Also, if you're here about a corporate account, I've been assured that deliveries will be back on schedule soon. Uh, um. Who, Jordan? <laughs> that kid's in here every other day with some random thing he found. Trying to get credits. Yeah, I took pity on him. Why? What is it? Sensitive scientific equipment. For, that's true. Just some dunk. None of your business. Does it matter? Can I just have it? How about this? Oh, really? Well, you can have it back for what I paid for it. Plus a oh. little extra. Let's call it a convenience fee, shall See we? See what being a nice guy costs me? You know what? I could, but I did pay for it. I'd like to recover my losses. And it's all the way in the oh back room. I'd have to walk back there, then back out here. I'll get he it for you. did say this was important after all. Honestly, it's probably worth way more than what we're talking about. Just... Pleasure doing business with you. Ugh. You know, I'd like to see what she has for sale. I hope we have what you need. I doubt it. Um... Ooh, I can sell things. Ooh, I can sell things? Buy back, no items, resources. Ooh. Value of stuff. I don't know what's valuable yet. Yeah, I don't know what's valuable yet. All that stuff. You mean besides providing a pleasant face for customers to interact with? Oh, yeah. It's all in the name. We distribute materials and products all around the United Colonies. Never a dull moment. Always something going on, and four other things we need to be ready for. I know some people don't believe it, but we really do the best we can. Wouldn't still be working here if I didn't care. Mm, fabulous. All right. Um, exit. Back to it, then. Yeah. Yes, thief. All right. Vasco, thanks for, uh, thanks for having my back in there, buddy. Let's take a look and see what my uh, it auto saved. Okay, let's take a look and see what my current deliver the sensors. Let's set a course for that. 
Uh, destination is Mass District. Can I just travel there now? Ooh, we can. I can appreciate that. So there is a reason to scan stuff. All right. Let's go ahead and take these sensors over to this guy and see if he rewards us with more than a handshake and a smile. I can't get enough of all the And then we'll go... I need all of the biosensors if the data is to be of any use. I'd like to know. Recent scans of the tree have suggested that a significant portion of the interior is liquefied. Obviously, some small percentage of its internal workings is always liquid to allow for the transfer of nutrients and so forth, but this? Well, I've never seen anything like it. If it continues to increase, I'm concerned the entire tree may collapse. And I'm also worried about other secondary effects. That's interesting. I'm a little curious about this one, but also... It's too soon to speculate. I'd very much like to see the additional data before I say more. All right. I'm fascinated. I really am. If the time comes, I will certainly attempt to alert the appropriate people in MAST. If I have more data, though, my concerns might carry some more weight. Understood. All right. At the end of the day, it's just a tree. I mean, yes, but is this just... I appreciate your confidence. The sooner I have all the available data, the sooner I can make an assessment. Just so happens I got stuff. So you do. Wonderful. I'll just take these, and we'll see what they have to tell us. All right. We'll just upload the data. Wait. Give it a moment. I guess I'm waiting. And just another moment. Uh, can I sit here and wait? It is working, isn't it? Oh my goodness, Kelt. I guess uh, I gotta come back and talk is. to you later. Relief. Now, let's see. This is... Well, it, it's... Oh my. Okay, hold on. Hold on. Come on. Well, there's good news and bad news. The good news is that my suspicions were correct. There is something wrong with the tree. I will report my findings to Mast immediately with no small amount of satisfaction. The phrase, I told you so, may even be uttered more than once. That doesn't sound like good news. Well, from a certain point of view. And, and... Admittedly, somewhat selfish manner. The bad news, as it were, is that the internal composition of the tree is changing. In this particular case, the tree is now regularly emitting ultra-low frequency sound waves. They're nearly imperceptible now, but they're growing in strength. This is something we've never observed before. Depending on how large these waves grow, consequences for the city could be well, disastrous. I must consult with my colleagues in MAST at once. Thank you for your assistance. I hope these credits are adequate compensation. 2,000 credits? All right, that was worth 100 bucks. I got some skill level points leveled up by hitting the menu button. I don't know what... Oh, do I go over here? Is this how I level up? Because I got two skill... Oh. Okay, I'm not ready to do this just yet. I will, I will, I will. But what we're going to do, check in on Keltum later. Okay, I will. I will do that. But first of all, let's go back to... Uh, are we back to... I could apply for that job. Take the artifact. Let's go here. Let's go to the lodge. Uh, let's set our course. And just travel to the Mass District. Okay. It would be fun to go ahead and walk all over the... Oh, hello there, citizen. Hey there. Hi. How you doing? Good? Okay. Um, let's go on up here. We've got a right-hand turn to make. Maybe some resting to do. I don't know. And uh, there is the marker on the map. It would be fun to navigate the city, just walk around. And I probably will do some of that, a lot of that, actually, on my off time. But... Uh, 
I do feel something of an urge to <laughs> run over the landscape here. And hey, you keep off the grass. But I also want to uh, I also want to progress the story just a little bit. It's fun. I'm I'm actually just really enjoying it. It's totally, totally chill. This is not Armored Core. This is not Hollow Knight. Here this we are. The lodge. The front door should unlock if you hold up the watch that Barrett gave you. Okay. I have messaged the other members of Constellation. They will be waiting for us inside. Tell you what, they're going to be waiting for us the next time. Because we've been at this for over the 45 minutes that I'm kind of aiming for a 45 minute episode so that it don't become so overwhelming. So I guess the next time we're together, we're going to go talk to Constellation. Thank you so much for joining me. I am the Preacher. This is Starfield. And I'm really enjoying it. Totally chill. Totally fun. I will see you the next time.